Patient, for patients with uh, advanced uh, hepatocellular carcinoma, we have uh, uh, two treatment options in first line, two immunotherapy combinations, uh, atezolizumab plus bevacizumab, and the combination of uh, durvalumab plus tremelimumab according to a new regimen with a single priming dose of tremelimumab called Stride. We also have tyrosine kinase inhibitors, sorafenib and lenvatinib, that we were used in, to use in the past before uh, immunotherapy. So most of patients nowadays receive immunotherapy. There are some patients who have contraindications for immunotherapy, for instance, patients with a prior liver transplant or patients with a severe autoimmune disorders, and those patients are good candidates for tyrosine kinase inhibitors. Or in some countries where uh, immunotherapy is not available, tyrosine kinase inhibitors still have a role also in first line. When we use uh, immune checkpoint inhibitors in first line, one combination or the other, then we use tyrosine kinase inhibitors in the following lines. We don't have a robust data for the following lines after immunotherapy, but still we can use uh, serafinib, lenvatinib, rogorafinib, cabozantinib, or ramosirumab after immune checkpoint inhibitors.